and we are live welcome back to another youtube video today in this video we're going to be talking about sleep it's a weird thing and i think a lot of young men around the world suffer from, from um, a lack of proper sleep like a proper um, sleep hygiene i think for me is like especially yesterday not even yesterday like today like I, I fucked myself so bad pause like i slept i was working by the way i wasn't playing games i was working until 5 a.m in the morning and then I slept and I woke up 1 p.m. today. <laughs> this is the opposite of what you want in a good sleep like hygiene. This is the opposite of what you want in a good sleep routine. I have sparring tomorrow. I have to sleep tomorrow so I can recover. What do I do with this time instead? No, 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 yeah. I'll, I'll just, I'll just, uh. I just keep staying awake and working. A lot of my friends were like, it's kind of a joke. We all just have shitty sleep schedules. It's not funny. It's not funny. What, what's funny about having shit sleep? <laughs> Nothing. You're the one suffering. Haha, uh -huh, my sleep schedule is so bad, I sleep at 3 a.m. in the morning. And then I and then I one up you. 5 a.m. And then another guy one ups me. 6 a.m. 7 a.m. And then another one motherfucker that just gets no sleep at all. He wins. What the fuck does he win? Brain damage? <laughs> Stunted growth? Lack of recovery? Lethargy? Come on man. This shit is so dumb. This sleep thing is so fucking dumb, like, it's my biggest issue by far. And I know what to do. But I'm stopping myself. I was gonna say something like, I know what to do, but I don't know about the strength of it. No, it's fucking bullshit. I should have worked at 5am. I would have got much less work done. Sure, yeah, no, I agree. But I shouldn't have worked at 5am. I should have been going to sleep. Now I'm paying the price. Who would have thought? I saw the sun come up through my blinds. And my blinds are pretty good at like blacking out light. But I can still see like the sun coming up and the sky turning blue. From black to blue. And it was the most depressing shit in the world. I kid you not, it was the most depressing shit in the world. And a lot a lot of young men and um the Japanese call it have a, a name for it as well, they're called hikikomori. A lot of young men who are disenfranchised, you can just check out from life have this same fucked up sleep schedule. You know this one this one dude, I'm not gonna call his name out. I'm gonna call him Steven again. Another Steven this time. I don't even know a fucking single Steven. But he's a pretty he's a pretty geeky a big geek. He admit himself like he's weak physically, he's weak mentally, emotionally, etc etc. In every possible physical aspect and every possible aspect he's usually a weak man. And he admits this and he doesn't give a fuck. Fair enough, you don't give a fuck. You don't want to be stronger, who cares? Like, I don't care. But, um, <laughs> I mean, I don't care if you don't care. But, um, yeah, I was, I was up at like 3 a.m. in the morning, like a degenerate, waiting for the Jake Paul fight with Nady Ass. And he was also up. But he was playing video games. And I thought to myself, this isn't like, um, like a, like a one-time occurrence. No, 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 no. This is a, like a, 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 mul a multiple-time occurrence. This is happening multiple times. Your sleep is just fucked. And then you list out things. I've got a girlfriend. And things that's going well for I've got a girlfriend. I've got a college education. I've got this, I've got that. Let me, let me try to find my messages. I found it just like... Where is it? 
I'm chilling right now, just went traveling, I've got good friends, I've got a girlfriend, I've got a college education. It's pretty, it's pretty I said pretty chill life, it's, it is a pretty chill life. But like... Is it an outlier life? No. Is that life going to be conducive to be you being great? No. How can you even be great in the first place? When one of the most basic things, like sleep, is managed. That's a message to me, that's a message to all the young men watching this video. Bro, like... <laughs> there are guys out here. Watch my videos. They sleep at 1, 2, 3 a.m. Every day. Wake up 1, 2, 3 p.m. Every day. That is a sick joke. And then you have like modern distractions just fucking you. Your phone, your tablet, your computer, everything just working against you in order for you to ruin your sleep. It's normal these days. Oh, I'm in bed. You always see the memes, right? Oh, I'm in bed, 5am and I'm still in bed. 7pm in bed. 12am in bed. 6am in bed. And then 1pm <laughs> in bed and you're just, you're just dozing off so nicely. Like, what the fuck? Is, is this a generation of insomnia? Like, no wonder all of us are fucked up. One of our, one of our most basic needs in the Maslow's hierarchy of needs, sleep, is fucked up. A lot of young men's eating schedule fucked up. Eating one or two meals a day at weird, unregulated times. Sleeping schedule fucked up. Sex, we're not getting any, they're not getting any of that. What, what else is um thing? In the Maslow's hierarchy. Mas Maslow hierarchy of needs. Air. Most young men's breathing are fucked up. They're breathing through their mouth. Water. The water is fucked. Fluoride. Food. Food's fucked. Shelter. A lot of young men are traumatized. Sleep. Yeah, I already talked about that. Clothing. Reproduction. I think the clothing's kind of stupid, but um. Yeah. But then again, I do have a lot of clothes. How would I go about like genuinely solving this issue? I can't just shout at these guys. Is there like a framework I can make? But then like what are the chances of guys following the framework? You know, guys they don't specifically like get one motivational speech and then, then they become your follower. No, men lead by example. Men follow an example. It's always been like that. It will forever to continue to be like that. It's like, it's like shit like communism doesn't fucking work because most people are like, and men as well, which is what I'm aiming at. They, I don't want to have seen their examples of fucking poor. Are there any other new ones like, with the ideology? Stop. Well, actually, it was state capitalism. Stop. No.
any effort of mine that has like I'm trying to shit this on this video. <laughs> any effort of mine that has like been directed towards trying to get better sleep kind of just got crushed, got destroyed. Like I, I would go to bed 8, 9 p.m., wake up the next day, 6 a.m., 7 a.m., wonderful, perfect, goal complete. And then the next day I would spend like 1, 2 a.m. And that's would be like, then the entire day working, doing my thing, like training hard, exercising, doing fucking demanding me mental tasks. But I'd still like end up fucking myself. And going to sleep at 1, 2 a.m. And then the cycle will repeat. And then it'll be like days where I'm like, oh, like a few days string and roll. Like, yeah, well, I'm getting good sleep. I'm fucking, I'm going to bed at the right time. No distraction, no phone, no tablet, nothing. I like to come up with these. Oh, oh, yeah, I'll read a little before I go to bed. No, no, no. That keeps me awake, bro. Just go to bed. And I made a routine and everything, but I don't follow that shit, bro. So, <laughs> what the fuck? I'm actually readjust my routine, but, um. Yeah. Not sure. I just got a nice video piece.